Hey guys at MDTV, it's Dave Mad Max 6 with Hide Tara Yamigishi for another M Muscle Beach TV interview. Welcome back to the show, Hide. Thank you. Thank you, Dave. Uh, my honor to be here. <laughs> <laughs> Your honor, my honor. I think it's like uh, we're saying probably like the fourth or fifth time since we have you on. I love having you on. Uh, uh, great friend of the show. And, and I want to talk to you because last time we actually sat down was shortly um, right around the time you got injured, and I think it was right after uh, you got injured, uh, and that you were still in the middle of you know guest posing and competing and all that stuff. So it's been a few months. How is the injury going? How's uh, how's everything since then? Well, uh, look at this. Uh, it's just you know score is there, but it's almost 100 percent. It's you know there is some tightness here, but I I think uh, it's not gonna be the same. So I I'm I'm happy with it. You know, so I can train whatever I want to do. So uh, I'm 100%, you know, uh, going for the show, which is our uh, Arnold Classic. Oh, nice. 2014, so I just- Ohio, Ohio. Yes, okay. yes. I just started prep. Oh, you did? Yeah. You still look in shape. You, you didn't really get too far off as far as, you know, weight-wise this year. Well, this year I was, you know, the after injury, I, I came down a little, you know, lighter weight, so, uh, I've been skinny. <laughs> oh, you've been more skinny than fat, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, this is kind of good. I'm, I'm kind of, you know, st uh, I mean, it's, I'm in prep, but it's been, s I start eating more food, you know, my so metabolism. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's what I'm trying to do. So now I, you know, eat more frequent, eat clean food. Uh, so I actually, I'm getting heavier, you yeah. know, just last uh, two weeks. Oh, good. So it's been good. Good, good. So you have a little bit of tightness and stuff, so it's it's just not the same as it was before. But it's not it's not uh, making the workout any harder. You can still train hard, and it, it hasn't affected your workout as as far as weights and everything. It has now just you know a couple of exercises like coring stuff. It's okay. it's a little different, but okay. it it doesn't bother me. It's just different. Okay, gotcha. That's good. So you, this is not going to affect any anything in the future. That's great. Um, You've been really, really busy. I know it's. Uh, this is like probably the third time we tried to reschedule back on the show because you've been traveling. You've been in, in China or Japan, uh, Japan, all over the place, uh, traveling with this party. You were in uh, Florida with Rich. Or so. Talk about your travel schedule the past few months. It's been busy. Right. I've been, you know, Spain for the Arnold, and uh, Florida. Both I went there with the Rich. You know, my boss. And, yeah. uh, How was that? I, yeah, uh, I've been uh, do, doing great relationship with Gaspar and, uh, you know, Rich himself. And, uh, you know, I I'm really appreciate how they treat me and how they treat us, you know, how they treat the sports. Yeah. And I'm very happy with, yeah. with Gaspar Nutrition. And uh, I also travel, you know, for myself. I was in Japan. I was in, uh, you know, uh, <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> somewhere I've, been, in Japan. I've been traveling f so almost every other week. I, I've been somewhere else, and uh, uh, lately I'm kind of back and forth here to Las Vegas because I just opened up my own juice bar and a supplement store, uh, which name is uh, Body Cafe. Body Cafe, okay. Mm -hmm. Where is in uh, uh, this gym, City Athletic Club? Okay. Which a lot of us did a photo shoot right after Olympia. Uh, uh, a lot of guys, I, I think, uh, the, when they're trained there, when I when they are in Vegas for Olympia, it's great gym and uh, uh, great you know atmosphere. It's kind of hardcore but uh, high end. Yeah. And uh, now they don't have goals, uh Flamingo, which was their right. mecca, you know, before. But now you know this city is really crowd. Get him like a mecca yeah. in Las Vegas. Yeah. All right. So for serious people over there. You actually had the grand opening. You've been open for two, three weeks already, but you had the grand opening last week, correct? Right. So uh, we've been open for about three weeks, okay. and uh, we've been great. And uh, last week we had a grand opening event, and uh, we had the uh, uh, Las Vegas local pros like Jay, full-time Miss Olympia Jay Cutler, Dennis Wolf, Amanda nice. Latoner. So many, you know, amateur guys and you know, came up support me, support us, and uh, it's not on. It's it's me and a uh, uh, nine-time Miss Olympia Iris yeah, Kyle. Yeah. Then uh, uh, other guy Chris, uh, he's a long-time uh, friend. He's a business guy. He used to have uh, this kind of, you know, supplement store. Okay. So we three all this uh, body cafe, and okay. uh, we've been great. So they do um, not only sell supplements, you know, wide uh, uh, variety of supplements, but also you have a smoothie bar and all that stuff, right? Ma you make food as well, or? Well, we don't we don't make 
food right there. We, we know less some, but we sell some, you know, ready to go food. Gotcha. Yeah, so there is food. Yeah, in the fridge. But the, our ah. main focus is more yeah. smoothie. Okay. Uh, we have like about 15 kind of smoothie, variety of smoothie, nice. like chocolate, you know, fruits. Nice. And uh, we use, our, of course, Gaspari, you know, okay. isofusion and a myofusion yeah. in it. And, uh, you know, not only protein, oh. but also we have uh, pre-workout, yeah. you know, oh, meal replacement, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, anybody yeah. coming to the gym, you know, to to improve their physical, you yeah. know, condition or, you know, bodybuilding show or there, there is a uh, uh, CrossFit, CrossFit, you know, oh. gym also oh, in City wow. Athletic Club and MMA ring. Wow. So we have... A uh, lot of you know, kind of street there, and uh, they enjoy our smoothie. Okay. Why? Why did you decide? I mean, of all the business you could have opened, why did you decide to focus on on a smoothie bar? Well, I've been I've been thinking, you know, whole my career doing what I'm gonna do after after <laughs> you this. You think about it. Now. Yeah, I never really came up, you know, with good idea, and uh, I, you know, everybody same. I wanna do something I love, so. Uh, right. I love bodybuilding, I love this sport, so, uh, you know, smoothie bar, I never really uh, thought about it before, mm -hmm. but I went, you know, I've been to Las Vegas many times because uh, Iris Kai is my nutrition coach, so uh, we train uh, in that gym mm -hmm. so many times, and uh, we noticed uh, there, there, is a, there was a space, you know, empty for, for years, so we just talked to the owner, the Jay, uh, he's a good guy. He's a very good guy, and uh, he's passionate. He used to be competing, so uh, he, we came up. You know, we together came up the idea. You know, we uh, first of all we was planning to do just supplement store, but right. you know, it's it's gym in the gym. So yeah. why you know why not just uh, serve the actual supplement, right actual yeah. protein, actual smoothie that's for awesome. the customer. Yeah. So. I think that's a good idea. Yeah, and I think it's, it's very smart also. I mean, obviously, you and Iris are, you know, your name is very good in the industry. But I think aligning yourself with someone who's actually been in the business and who owns Juice Bar is very smart because then at least you can learn all the things to do and not to do, right? Right. Yeah, well, you know, for me, it's, it's a first, you know. I've been doing the sports all my, all my life after school. So I never really got into this kind of business. So ever since, you know, running process for me. Mm -hmm. But Chris is, uh, you know, like I said, he has a lot of experience. So mm -hmm. uh, Iris has experience too. Mm -hmm. So I'm running from them, I'm running from customer. Every day is challenging, but I enjoy it. That's great. You, you gonna move to Vegas uh, eventually or you wanna stay in California? Mm, uh, well, you know, uh, actually the the gym goes Venice. Yeah. That's the reason why I yeah. move here. Yeah. So uh, as long as I'm competing, I I wanna stay here and I yeah. train goals. but. You know, as a business owner, I have to be there sometimes. So, like every other week, I go there, and uh, you know, it's only one hour. It's not far, yeah, it's right there. So, so, I'll be, like uh, next week, I'm going there yeah. and I stay there. But as I get close to the show, I stay here yeah, and I, you know, focus on training, which you know, two other owners already agree. So. Yeah. How, um, let's talk about your, your return to the stage and, and the Arnold Classic and stuff. Um, how do you feel, um, I mean, it's been a really, really uh, strong year, bodybuilding-wise this year, a lot of new guys up and coming. So how do you, how do you feel next year is going to go for you now that you're back 100% in the gym? How do you, uh, I mean, you had your best finish at the Arnold last year, fifth place, correct? So how do you feel this year is going to be going for you? Uh, my, uh, as long as my body is responding really good, because mm -hmm. uh, I've been competing so long, uh, last how couple long, of years. How long? Uh, uh, <laughs> how many shows? I don't really know, but you no, know. But how many years? How many years? Uh, since uh, 2000, 2007. As I, a pro. As a pro, yeah, yeah. yeah. I I've been you know at least you know three four three four shows sometimes eight shows in a year, so uh, I I think I need less, yeah. and uh, this you know this happened so I forced to 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 less but you know i think it was good because my body started responding you know better yeah last you know last year i i mean this year you know beginning of this year arnold i i did good but i felt real difference i i thought i was getting older but 
I think just uh, I didn't have enough rest. Yeah. So yeah. dieting and dieting, competing, competing. Yeah. It's good, but sometimes you need rest. Yeah. Well, it's good when, you cu when you're up and coming and now that your name is established, you know, sometimes it's better to just compete less and do better, right? right. So, well, Hide, I'm, I'm, really, I'm really glad you came by the store. I'm very excited about, about the grand opening, about your new business, and I really, uh, I, would have, I was hoping I could have gone, you know, to actually put that on tape and document, but I, I wasn't able to go. But next time I go to Vegas, I really want to make sure that, that you're there, and then uh, we'll do a little piece on your new business and show the gym and all that stuff for the MD, uh, MDTV fan, okay? All right, thank you. Thank you very much. And this is the holidays. We're just about to have a Thanksgiving next week, and of course, it's going to be a little bit of hiatus for the holidays, but then we will be back uh, in March for the Arnold Classic, correct? Yes. All right. I will see you in Ohio. <laughs> All right, you guys, that's it. It's Dave Mad Max 6 with Hiridara, and then uh, we'll catch you next time for another Muscle Beach TV interview. And we're out. What's up? This is Cedric McMillan. Now, I told you before to go to MD Supplement Store. Now, you need to get down there and get all your stuff or else. <laughs>